Alrighty, let's just go and park my car, ship underneath my garage, and going in easy and stop. Crap. I need a better garage. Oh. Hey guys, Tanner69046 there. I didn't see you there, I was just looking over the model data for today and the storms. Because we're going on a storm chase today, um, here in the National Weather Service office. Uh, yeah, we got our model data on our MacBook over here. Uh, got our tornado siren, just in case something sneaks up on us here in the office. We got us a radar right here. Uh, go outside, and here's our storm mobile. Let me pull it up next to the docking point so that we can load up here in a minute, and we'll start out our day. Here we are. And we can do better than that. Keep wait. Alright, disassemble ship. There we go. Yep. Okay. There we go. Uh oh, we're gonna need a better garage one day. Yeah, the model day is showing Ah, I hit, accidentally hit unrecord. Model day is showing a decent chance of severe storms today. Um so yeah, welcome to Storm Chasers in Minecraft, um episode one. Oh, let me give you a tour of the Storm Chaser Mobile. Uh, this baby can fly. We got floaters and got our hot air balloon material. We got us our siren, which can be activated whenever we see a storm and need to land. Uh, we got our steam engine, which is powering this baby. We got our radar on the floor. We got our seat, which can be easily removed whenever we need to... Uh, Whenever we need to, you know, actually view the whole radar just in case. We got us our gauges. We got us some crates. I have it on peaceful because I don't feel like fighting hunger or mobs. Uh, yep. Like I said. Twister or bust. Haha. <laughs> Alright, so I'm, uh... I'm gonna come back to you all when, uh, tomorrow. Whenever the fresh day will start. I'm gonna go sleep. We'll come back and we'll get the chasing. So, I'm, um, uh, yeah. Be right back and we'll get this sucker started. Alrighty guys, so it's a fresh new day and stability is building. Um, like I said, we're here in the Twister Mobile. The model data overnight didn't change much. Just a moderate risk of severe storms by the SPC. Um, yep, we got one popping already. Uh, let's check it out on radar. It's located to our west and it is moving, was it northeast? Yeah, it's going east. But is it going to be eastern or northern? Can't tell yet. There hasn't been any movement. Oh, northeast. We got us a northeastern moving storm. Let me just yeah, get the map up there. Uh, so, um, uh, since it's moving northeast, and uh, we got an environment where these winds are probably going to start rotating. We should probably move a little bit to the South, west, no, southeast. We can move over here to this hilltop over here, and I think that'll be a great spot. Um, I already recorded episode one once. I had an F4 on the ground, but um, uh, my microphone wasn't recording, and I hope it's recording this time, because if not, I'm going to be sad. So yeah, let's just go land on this hilltop over here. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, it's a village. The storm is heading straight towards the village. Hopefully it spares them. Um, I had five. Well, I'm not even going to talk about... This is just going to be our first recorded day. A tornado hasn't happened yet, so yeah. <laughs> um, let's get disassembled the ship here. No rotation sighted in this storm yet. Uh, oh yeah. Still moving. It's got a great northeast movement on this thing. Oh, now we got some rotation in the clouds. We're watching it, so I'm gonna I'm gonna keep doing this until this thing might drop a tornado. So I'm gonna time lapse this and see if we can get some rotation out of this. So be right back as I time lapse it.
Alrighty guys, so um, uh, this thing's got some strong northeast return on it, so um, uh, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna we're gonna relocate because I think this village is gonna be safe, other than the fact that storms like these have been known that if they put a tornado down, the tornado will guide it, and this sucker could turn back more to an easternly flow. But um, uh, I've been noticed some increased rotation. Yep, yep, increased rotation there. Uh, there's enough rotation on radar that's suggesting a tornado could touch down with this. Uh, we don't have anything yet, but you know what? We're keeping a close eye on it. You know, let's get up on this hill. Still nothing. Radar saying there's some extremely well-defined rotation out of this. Uh, could definitely. Oh, there's a funnel touching down, touching down. Do we have a tornado on the ground? Yep, tornado on the ground. Yep. Strong defined rotation with a tornado on the ground. Now it's got a strong... Uh, we're looking at a strong northeastern flow. Oh, we're quickly strengthened to an F1 here. Uh, let's relocate. A simple ship mount. Let's go. Let's go relocate to a place where we can get a better angle on this sucker. Uh, you're safe, village. You know, ignore the tornado sirens. Uh, let's see, can we get a path on this thing? Uh, yeah, it's definitely... I don't see any blocks or anything picked up from it yet, but... Oh, that's an F2. We have an F2 on the ground. Put the brakes on. It's picking up some grass, it looks like. Uh, we need to be checking this path often so that we're not in it. Uh, we'll have to report this to the National Weather Service. It's a wide tornado. Which way is this thing going? We need direction. Direction. Where are we heading? Two. Oh, it's gonna pass, pass right in front of us here. It looks like, like I said, this quickly strengthened to an F2. Uh, yeah, look at it. Oh, it's picking up some gravel. You see that gravel? It almost looks like it's going to an F3. No, no, okay, not an F3. So just an F2. It's got some gravel in there, so that's gonna be painful if you get sucked in. Okay, yep. Uh, the radar indicates that the storm is, um, is losing its height, so it looks like, well, for the most part, we're just gonna get an F2 out of this. I wouldn't suspect that this thing, uh, gets any more. Uh, what we're gonna do, though, is, since we know that it's not gonna build anymore, we are going to go ahead and we are going to get in front of this thing, and we are going to see if there's any anything in its path. Uh, we gotta make sure that there aren't any villages that could be affected by this. Uh, there's a lot of small villages who probably don't even have the technology to know that the tornado is coming. So we have to go ahead and jump in front of this path. Oh, it's picking up horses. We have horses. Uh, yep, we're jumping in front of its path here. Not seeing any villages. Uh, like I said, there's some small villages that are not really connected to society. We gotta make sure that these things aren't in danger. Uh, it appears that no, no villages. Uh, we should probably pass. Um, go back in front of this thing just a little bit. Let's land by these trees over here next to the small lake. Yep. Going down. Come on, going for a good landing, and come on. I hear you chickens. Uh, yep, there she is. Got the siren activated again, just in case there is some nearby village. Oh, there it is. Yep, it's gonna cross right in front of us over here. Oh, that's a nice lightning shot, you see that? Let's remove the seat here, because it is gonna go right there. Alright, so no casualties with this storm so far, which is a good thing. Uh, it doesn't, we didn't spot any nearby villages that could be affected by this, which is always good. Uh, it looks like the tornado is turning towards a more, uh, a more eastward direction instead of north. It's almost like a southeast now. Oh! And it's picking up. 
the rotation is gone, it's picking up, and it's just a weakening thunderstorm. No rotation at all with this now. Alright, so um, uh, that was day one of storm chasing. The other one I recorded was like an hour long. This thing, this thing was on the ground for a while, but like I said, we couldn't. The um, uh, <laughs> recording s software didn't pick up my microphone, man, so I couldn't do anything about that. Uh, let's go check out the path of this thing. We still will have some lightning with this, but I don't see any strong winds or rotation or anything being picked up on radar. So, yeah, I got right to those leaves. It picked up a few leaves, it looks like, and then picked up. So we had a F2 on the ground for a while. It didn't really pick up or lose intensity or anything like that. It's just an F2. Uh, so, yeah, it's followed the path. It turned into an F1 right about here. Or it was at an F1. Now, uh, yep, that was the village right there. And quickly, it was an F1. It quickly strengthened to an F2. And then for like a, probably 20, 10, 15 blocks, it was just an F0. So yeah, it was the path of the first tornado in F2 with zero casualties. Uh, we'll go back and we'll report this at the station. So, yeah, uh, we gotta go this way. No, we gotta go the other way. Kind of like this direction. We need to really go towards 212, or 200 and 500 to where the base is at. So let's go there, we'll put this thing up on the wall. Now can we get a good landing? Hold on. Alright, yep. Let's just ease her in. Slow her down, slow her down. Alright, yep. I can't really see much here. Uh, oh, we gotta pick it up a little bit more. Okay, so. Yep, alright, now just slowly ease her down. Alright, so now we're on the ground, we can just. We can just slowly reposition this. Alright, yep, there we are. Disassemble ship. How'd we do? Eh, we did okay. Alright, still got plenty of fuel, so we'll be good. Uh, let's go in here. Long day, you know. Uh, let's go in here. Yep, nothing on radar. The instability's gone. Wind shear, you know. It's, eh. Alright, so let's just spawn in a few signs. We should probably get a chest here. Full of signs. Uh, yeah, let's do that. Let's get some signs. We're just going to fill this thing up with signs. So for future reference, we'll be able to... Uh, we'll be able to use this like, hey, oh, yep, yeah, just grab a sign out of here. <laughs> Alright, so um, uh, we'll have plenty of signs too. <laughs> As you can see, we're just going to spam this thing full of signs. Oh, yep. Sorry if y'all can hear the noise from me, like, constantly clicking my mouse um <laughs> just trying to fill this thing up yep almost there one last row all right oh crap so now we can go into survival mode and let's just grab two signs uh what wall can we do this on oh yes confirm tornadoes and casualties. Day one. F2 tornado. Zero casualties. Alrighty. So day two, day three, day four, day five. Wait, no. Day two, day three, day four, day five, day six, day seven, day eight, day nine. And then we'll probably move it somewhere else if we have to, but yeah. Alright, so I'm, uh, that's going to do it for this episode of. Minecraft's Tornado Chasers. Um, we had one on the ground. I don't know. If there's some days that I don't even get a tornado on the ground, I might show it, you know. Uh, there's some days that these episodes are going to be 40 minutes long, or some days they're just going to be 10 minutes long, depending on the type of tornado. Like, if we get an F0 on the ground for 5 minutes, and that's all we get, then that's all we get, and that's all the episode's going to be. 
We have an F5 on the ground for three hours, and I will cut that up and release a 40-minute episode, because I'm not uploading for three hours. <laughs> Alright, so, um, yeah, like, comment, subscribe if you enjoyed this episode of Tornado Chasers. Um, in Minecraft, uh, well, Minecraft edition. Uh, Tornado Survival Season 5 episode out tomorrow. Um, leave a comment on what you thought about this. Uh, I'm going to be recording some Euro Truck Simulator 2 and uploading that, too, because you all told me to do that and that had the most upvotes and like I said I love doing that game so if you all like it then I'll upload it so yeah I'm, uh, thanks for watching and I guess I'm gonna see you all in the next one bye oh yeah and by the way just leave a comment what you thought on this new series any suggestions and all that like comment subscribe I'm gonna see you all in the next one on day two bye